It's nice to have you waking up with us. Boy, pretty exciting stuff. We had um, some snow overnight. We want to take you live to an ODOT camera to show you some snow-covered roads this morning. Um, in other areas, the snows are wet, uh, the roads are wet, and so we'll be talking more about this coming up. But if you take a look at that light on the upper left-hand side of your screen, you can see that snow really coming down. This is up in government camp. In the metro area, it may be another story as you look out the door. Uh, let's get to Drew Reeves this morning for a look at our first live local forecast. Pretty exciting stuff yeah, to wake up definitely. to definitely. It was nice na last night to see it falling. If you were up late enough to be able to see that, this morning might see a little bit of white on the ground, but for the most part, we have transitioned just to rain here. Here's a view from our Mary Hill Tasting Room and Bistro Camera in Vancouver. No snow out there right now, 33 degrees. The one thing you might notice is possibly some slick roads, especially if you've got a little bit of that slush still left on the roads. Most of the spots around the metro right above freezing. In fact, everybody above freezing right now, aside from Welch's, but plenty of spots right there around 33 degrees. Want to be cautious in those areas. Could be a little bit slick out there on our windshield weather as you head out uh, early this morning. It's going to look a little different than it did last night. It'll be cloudy with just showers. It'll actually be a little bit drier to the north of Portland as well. Portland possibly getting a little bit of a dry period this morning, but we uh, have plenty of wet weather on the way coming up here in a few minutes. We'll also talk about some snow heading into the gorge tonight. All right, Drew, thank you. As we mentioned, some of you are waking up to snow in your yards this morning. Others might just be seeing rain. Foxwell's Deborah Gill joins us from Southwest Portland this morning. Deb, where are you and what are you seeing? Actually, I moved to uh, Northwest Portland. We're in Northwest Skyline near Burnside up at the top of Sylvan Hill. And there are a few flakes kind of falling right now, but it is really wet. It's almost almost rain, but not quite. And you can definitely see that slush on the road that Drew was talking about. And we know that this is just the start of the season for winter weather. And Peabot says they are ready to help you get where you need to go. All, in fact, area transportation crews have been gearing up for the possibility of snow this week. We saw that earlier this week, many of you did, and a bit more for some folks last night, clearly here up on the 1,000 feet elevation, and more could be on the way for Christmas. We're watching the uh, weather forecast. We've got uh, plenty of our supplies, and we've checked out our equipment. So uh, we are winter ready, and we encourage the public to be winter ready as well. We know a lot of people will be traveling this week, and Rivera says one of the biggest things you should remember is even if you don't live in higher elevations and have to drive those roads, the road to your destination might be higher. So always be prepared for snow and ice during the winter if you're traveling. And that means slowing down, leaving more room between your car and other cars. Carry a first aid kit. And also it's a good idea, he says, to have a blanket, water, some snacks just in case you get stuck and uh, you're okay while you have to wait for help. Reporting live in Northwest Portland, Deborah Gill, Good Day, Oregon. All right, Deb.